everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another Ravishing Review. Today we are looking at the Ultimate X Match for the TNA X Division Championship between DJZ, currently Joaquin Wild of Legado Del Fantasma, uh, taking on Manic, also known as TJP, Andrew Everett, and the champion Tigre Uno. This is from TNA Bound for Glory 2015. Meltzer give this a three and a half star rating out of five. Looks like Manic inspired Dominic Mysterio with his ring gear. That stupid hood that doesn't come off. That's ridiculous. Um, anyway, Manic on Uno before the bell even rings, but it quickly breaks down. Everett with a double drop kick on DJZ and Manic. Uno with a big springboard crossbody. Looks like Uno tries uh, to go for a code red here, but Everett counters with um, a very slow, awkward-looking Alabama slam. Double arm drag by Uno on Everett and Manic. Um, about to dive to the outside, but DJZ cuts him off. DJZ with a springboard curb stomp on Uno, then uses his body to hit a poetry in motion uh, to the outside on Manic. Uno follows with a corkscrew plancha on DJZ and Uno. Ever follows with a big springboard shooting star press. Um, holy smokes, that kid got high. This gives him an opening to climb for the title. Manic follows Everett up and kicks him down. DJZ throws Uno over his head and into Manic, who hits a face buster. Both guys kind of very briefly stare each other down and then start climbing up. DJZ throws Manic down, then Manic pulls him down and adds on a code breaker just for good measure. Uno with a Dragon Sleeper Stunner on DJZ then starts to climb. Manic knocks Uno down with a springboard drop kick. Then Everett lands a big old flippy doo on Manic. Um, initially, I had this rode down as a 630, but then I watched it back. And it's way more than a 6.30. I, God, don't, don't even know. And I'll tell you why here in a second it wasn't a 6.30. Um, DJZ and Everett climbing up the steel structure holding Ultimate X. Uh, DJZ hits Everett's head on the structure. Uh, both men fall. Uno to the top hits a 6.30 on the floor on DJZ. Uh, crazy spot from Uno. Manic and Everett going for the title with Everett tightrope walking across and Manic uh, climbing across the cables. Everett steps on Manic's hand. Um, he falls. Uno shimmies across the cables to join the fray. Uno kicks Everett in the head. He crashes to the mat. Like, it was a thud. Um, but Uno retains the title. Um, I'll push here and go three and a half stars out of five. Uh, the action was fast and furious. Ah, fool. Um, shouldn't have done that. Um, everyone took a few bumps here that looked rough. Um, there were too many cutoffs, though. I feel like there were there were a couple of, of instances where guys are cutting other guys off um, that would kill the momentum of the spot they were getting to. Um, there was some hecticness about this that was... A little bit middle of the road for me. I wasn't sure if I liked it or not. Um, but this match was missing something. Um, like a spark. Like um, like charisma or like swagger. Um, nobody in this match is like main event level status. Um, but all these guys put in the work and it was a really good match. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Check out our social media links in the description. Be sure to tune in to the PWO WrestleCast, the premier professional wrestling podcast, every Monday live at 7 p.m. on Facebook. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time for another ravishing review.